Hi everybody, it's the Stein Sibs here. I'm Mike. I'm Evie. Today we have uh, something wonderful. Yeah. It is pink gin. It's uh, from the discount grocery store. What's? I don't really know how to pronounce it. It's like Casteljai. What would you call it? Castle G. Castle Jai. Okay. Castelgi. Ka- Castelgi. 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 Let's go with Castel. Castelgi. I think Castelgi sounds kind of a little fancy, maybe. Castelgi. Castelgi. Yeah, let's call it Castelgi. It is uh, pink gin. It is made with like berries, I guess. Mm-hmm. Uh, How much should we pay for it? Like five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. Oh, it's got uh, raspberries. Uh, Current, red current, and strawberries. Ooh. And it is um, 37.5%. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, this is a 70 ounce bottle, so. Um, We're going in. Yeah. So we've got some ice here, too. We gotta, we gotta give it this. Oh, first we gotta give it a little. little yeah, the straight ugh. test. Okay, this Come is on, you, have even, you haven't even tried it yet. No, I haven't, of course. That, um, was, that was for mom. She was, did her taxes today. She was doing her taxes today. She needed a drink. She needed a little gin tonic. Okay. Here's my cold. Cheers. Smells sweet. Uh, mm. oh. it, could have be, it could be so much worse. It could be much worse, but... I don't know. Maybe because like, I have been a young woman in the past... Yeah, I remember this one time in college. Um, I'm used to like really sweet pink stuff, but that's not that bad to me. <sighs> really? We we got uh, like this like you're just pretending raspberry Fleischmanns, and we mixed it with like raspberry, raspberry Kool Aid powder, and it was just like I remember throwing up from it, and like since then I can't actually. I'm surprised I didn't throw up instantly when I tasted that. Oh my god. <sighs> That's not that bad. Yikes. You just have um, some history. Are you going to try So we've got... Um, yeah, it is gin. So we've got just regular got tonic mixers. water here. And then we've got... Yeah, we got uh, I got some um, ginger, ginger beer. beer. But the thing is, we don't know because it says tonic water, it says tonic ginger, water ginger, beer, ginger beer. So we don't know if it's tonic water... No, ginger beer flavor tonic water. If it's actual, I, just regular ginger there's beer. There's only so really one way to find out. Cool, I'm gonna just do mine. Why don't we do one of each? A eh? Michael? Should we um, just make one and then just try even here? I can Do you have yeah. a bottle opener? Well I can open it for you. Let's just say that. I got it. Well <clears throat> talented right here. You wanna just make one of each and then we can try it and see which one's best? I mean, best as in like relative terms. What if you end up really enjoying it? I'll be surprised. Okay. Cheers. Oh, bless I, your little cotton sock. I didn't Here, really enjoy that. it. Like not a lot. I like the way this smells. I like it. I like it with the ginger oh, beer way more than it's with better the Better than that, yeah. Well, the ginger just like masks everything. You really hate it that much? I kind of like it. Because I have a history with this kind of flavor. I know, maybe, maybe, uh, yeah. Really don't like it? Man, I mean, you can have the rest of that. I don't, I don't. Share it with mom. I, I mean, also like it's I pink don't. gin. I mean, like how... That, I mean, that would not. Oh. All right. Okay, no, I, so let's go to the. Uh... I mean, like for mixing, also no. For like, have it around the house in case, like, I would like a uh, case. adult beverage. No. I mean, it's just kind of like a. I gotta give that like a one. I mean, really, this is something that you buy if you are a like, eighteen-year-old girl. 
and like you're going out. You know what I mean? And it's like your first time drinking. Yeah, or you're a 20 By year, the way, 20 year old a, boy. Only in a country uh. where obviously uh, drinking is allowed at that age. Or allowed, period. Or allowed, period. Yeah. Fair You point. folks in dry counties, you keep your hands off. You don't even think about it. Yeah. Um, that being said, um, this is like a novelty thing that you like try once when you're like a kid, basically. And then you're not going to really purchase it once you turn like it, 26. I mean, because, <laughs> like, yeah, I don't know. I, I'm 24, so I'm still allowed to enjoy this. I'm still scared of giving it a one because I, I Listen, don't know. It's the worst we've tried so far. Once you're allowed to buy uh, 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 rent oh, a car, oh, licking my don't lips drink is this. disgusting. Oh, I don't mind it that much. It's oh. he's totally overreacting. I, I'm I'm just traumatized. You know, you totally overreacting. Many people have this with like tequila, where they like can't can't taste it. I'm thinking else. if I have it with any kind of booze. Give me the ginger stuff back. At least um, that's like have it. Semi palatable. I don't think I do. Boring. I don't think there's any kind of type of booze where I'm like I can't. Wait no. Okay. It's not that I can't. I just. You don't. Well, you shouldn't. You clearly. Really don't want to. Oh my god. Um, anyway, so if you're on a budget, by the way, should we say the story that we bought this in? The what? The store that we bought it in, because you just said discount grocery store. Yeah, I mean sure. It's Lidl. We bought it at Lidl. It was five ninety nine. I, I doubt that the pink vodka from Aldi is any better. They they have pink vodka. I mean pink gin. Sorry, this is pink gin. Um, yeah, but there's other discount stores, though, like right, aside from Aldi and Lidl. I guess we'd have to compare the pink gin from all the discount grocery stores. We could do that for my birthday. Oh, my God. <laughs> guess I still have time to brace myself. Yeah, you do. My birthday Anyway, so I'm, I'm going to give it a... I'm gonna get a well, out of 10. One. We're doing out of 10, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm giving it a 1. Okay, I'm going to give it like a 4. Like, no. Okay, is it? it's not good gin, okay? It's really not good gin. I think maybe, I'm thinking about the kids here. I think maybe if we're making jungle juice or something, pop it in there, spice it up a little bit. Then all is lost anyway. So. What, yeah, that's true. I mean, you might as well just be drinking lighter fu- uh, fluid at that yeah. point. Um, um, okay, I'm going to give it a, I'm going to give it a four and a half. Okay, yeah, I'm going to give it a one. Yeah, I'm just going to give it nope. a, you hate this stuff, Jerry. Nope, you really nope, don't like nope, it. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> it's nothing that anyone needs to have in their booze cupboard. If you are someone that likes cocktails and like likes to have an adult drink from time to time, maybe don't buy even, this. Yeah, don't. I mean, don't bother. It's really just like a cute little novelty thing. If you're young and you want to get messed you up, you buy your daughter for her twenty-first birthday or whatever. Don't buy this. Well, don't buy this. Get get a don't nicer one. At least a, get yeah. Gordon's or something. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, big oof from me. One out of ten would not buy again. Oh my god, I'm me five years ago. I would have lived off of this. Yeah, I mean, like me nine years ago, puked off of this. So it's like it brings me back to the being horribly, horribly sick off like raspberry vodka and and Kool Aid and just yeah. It's no from me, dog. Yeah. It's no from your dog? Okay. It's, yeah. It's a... Well, I mean... So, eh. what's the average of one in four? Like a, <clears throat> one in four and a half? One in four and a half? <clears throat> that would be... The average of that would be... Oh, no, we're going to embarrass ourselves. But no, uh, 2.75. That's... That's... I guess I can settle for it being that low. Yeah, yeah. 2.75. So, uh, this gets... Yeah. yeah, it gets an average of 2.75. Yeah. But like I said, kids... Not kids, but young folks of legal drinking of age. Of legal drinking age. If you have... You're going to... Regardless you have no of what standards, we say, you're you going to make no this standards, experience anyway. Have it. Definitely. Live it. Love it. Puke it. Hate it. <laughs> you know? It's... Yeah. I mean, yeah. He's not wrong. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, I got a seven point, <laughs> uh, 2.75, excuse me, uh, for the uh, Ca- Castel Jai... Pink gin. Castelgi. Let's know. not make I, it. I, I, try I don't and make know. it anything it's not. It is distilled pink gin. Mm hmm. Okay. It also gives you a little recipe for how to make a gin and tonic on the back. Yeah, for, so, so for all you beginners. So that's really you got You got a kit. 
you got a kit here. Yeah, you got a full kit. Well, you need to buy the tonic, you need, but... Yeah, that's just... Little yes. secret, you need tonic. <laughs> I recommend the ginger beer if you're gonna do this to yourself. Yeah. Moscow Mule? No, Munich Mule. That. Yeah, Munich it is a Munich Mule, gin, yeah. but like it's still not a Munich. Not meal. with pink gin, and I, 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 I don't know, no, 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 no. Anyway, um, that's all from us. Um, we do have our other project coming up. We were mm. we we're gonna do it last week. We were we're kind of like uh, logistically shooting new takes. Didn't work out. Uh, just didn't uh, pan out the way we planned. But we've but it's, learned a lot, so we hope that it's coming right up. It'll come right up, and it'll be um, the level of quality that you guys deserve. That you deserve, and that you know and love yeah. from the Stein Sibs. So um, <laughs> like and subscribe. Stay tuned for our new stuff. We hope you enjoyed this. Yeah. Um, Again, feel free to leave suggestions. We hope you learned this lesson at our expense. And uh, take it easy, everyone. We'll see you next time. Take care, you guys. Bye-bye.